Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Everyone. Yeah. Swong si ada. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Oh. It's gonna be 461 pounds. Big show. Oh my god. It's Sandra, it's a box inside a box. Keep your things dry. Dry? Basically, a dry box is like, you know, a dehumidifier for, you know, dehumidifying the air inside the box. Okay. Uh, we get a lot of questions on the gears, the lens, the camera we use. This is a good opportunity. Okay, so let's put this away first. Let Blackface summon all the camera and lens. So let's just let Blackface summon all the gear. Let's do this. So the camera we are using is Panasonic Lumix GH4. What I love about this camera it is cheaper compared to the other good cameras. The body is cost for 4,000 yeah, 800 at the time we bought it. It has Cine V, Cine D that we always use. Yes. Cine D is a bit flatter than the other color profile and the other one is Cine V. What we always use is a slow-mo variable frame rate that is 96. 96p. Other than that, we are using 60p for most of the time and sometimes we are shooting in 4K, 24p. And the body is very light because it is mirrorless. The lens cheaper. is cheap because it is micro-faulted. Yeah, talking about the lens, here are the lens that we use most of the time. The first one, we are using 20mm lens. This one is white. And you can do close up as well. This yeah. is the boss of all lens. This is the first lens that we bought. Yep. It has 1.7 1. Mm, 1. 1. 1. 7 7 aperture. aperture. And this is really good. The next lens is this uh, 75mm f1.8 Olympus lens, which we got. The reason we, that we got this lens is because of the nice bokeh gives up. This is actually a very close lens, very zoomed in to capture uh, it's sort of a portrait lens, I guess. This is good when we are shooting weddings and also close ups. So, basically, if you want to start, we suggest that you can get one camera 20mm and also 75mm. So, basically, you have this, then you are good to go. For micro four thirds lens, you have to times two because yeah. the, the sensor inside is cropped, so it's like a more micro four thirds size. And it's very small. The good thing about the GH4, or maybe if you plan to get the GH5, is that these are compatible with Olympus lens and also uh, Panasonic microfocus lens. Right, this is my 17mm lens, also a cine lens, so I quite love it because it's small and light, so everywhere I go, I just use this lens. And the yeah, picture is yeah. also 1.7. Yes, 1.7 aperture. And we also have this uh, Lumix macro lens, 30mm and then 2.8 for the aperture. Of course, for really, really extreme close-up shots. For example, the wedding rings, ants in the jungle, extreme close-up shots. Oh, I have this 9 to 18 millimeter, and this lens is a very wide lens, but the aperture is 4 to 5.6, so actually it's quite dark. I got this zoom lens as well. This one is Lumix and it is 45mm to 150mm. It can zoom very very far and the good thing about this lens is it has a built-in OIS which means uh, when you are traveling you can just put on a strap and you can just start. For events this is very good because you can just zoom on the stage and you can get the expression. But for the aperture this one is also 4.0 to 5.6 which is also very dark. The things that we don't like about the GH4 is definitely its low light. This is our wide lens. It's 12 to aperture, but it's an old one. It is scratch. Yeah, it's already scratch. Yeah. But sometimes we're still using it. We bought a new one. Yeah. Samyang. One. Samyang. Samyang. Made in Korea. Yeah. <laughs> Samyang. Samyang. <laughs> This one is quite heavy, but the setting is quite smooth when you, when you try to focus. Compared to this one, if you want to set the aperture, yeah. this one is no sound. 
then this one is more solid than and this one is T T 2.2 right? T 2.2 so basically our lens there are Sanyang there are Olympus Olympus Lumix, Lumix G I don't know what this G means Panasonic G Spot that's what she said <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> yeah these are the lenses for our, all our vlogs all the cinematics are shot using our stretch four and also our drone which is Mavic and Phantom I've talked about it in previous vlog so our vlog camera yeah is this one we shoot our vlog is already this one yes, my yes. baby girl yeah baby girl this one is a gorilla pod I'm sure you saw this before so this one is blackface baby girl yeah. but it's more suitable for girls like you no no yes like you yes I yeah, and that. it also has the flip screen. Yeah, this one. you can capture selfie. Yeah, it is quite good, but we might get another one for our vlog. Yep, so basically that's all. So let's put it in our bag box. Yeah, so do it! Eventually. We still don't know how to use this actually, so we're going to take our time to read this. Uh, after this, we will be going to Kelvin's studio. So by that time we're shooting, we'll be using different lenses to shoot some example shots for you in our showtime! Like this video and you want to have like more content, click and subscribe for our channel and maybe give it a thumbs up if you like it. You can click right here to watch our previous video. Peace! Bye-bye. Peace! Peace.